Hello everybody and welcome back to Electric Mindset. We're going to continue, or not really continue, we're going to give another shot at Paranormal here. Uh, before I was playing like a free version I had found, it wasn't the full release. I purchased the full release because I loved it so much and we're going to find out what's in that basement. We're going to jump right in here, I'm just going to start it all up. I also want to say that uh, my streaming and all the videos I make on YouTube might slow down a little bit just because my computer's experiencing some problems. Uh, one of my hard drives, the main hard drive I use for all my games, is actually disappearing all the time and crashing. My computer is just, just going haywire, so I have to take it in to get it looked at because I've looked at it myself and I'm not 100% sure what's going on with it. So I'm probably going to make a video long jump on in. I got my headset turned up too loud again because that's the only real way to go through it. We're going to go for the full recording. It's uh, Friday, July 1st, 2011. Hello. <coughs> Excuse me. I'm an artist <coughs> and I've come to believe that my house is haunted. We've seen this before. Let's begin. This all looks the same. Shit. Well, well, we're getting started early. Okay, we're jumping right into it, apparently. Your footsteps. So this episode is going to be longer than my normal episodes just because I want to get through it. What is he doing? What is going on right now? What are you doing? Hey, stop it. Just you stop it right now. Instant rain. Oh, man. Okay, so I remember from the first time I played this, I was watching it. The safe clearly has something to do with that key, I think. Oh, so far. You know. Let's go check the garage. <laughs> yeah, my radio's going a little haywire. My radio's going a little haywire there. Car lights are coming on. 11, 1984. I'm not alone in this house. I can feel Marcus watching. He knows about Jeremy. He knows about the baby. I've never been a religious woman, but I need to find more than ever. August 23rd, 1984. I woke up this morning only to find Jeremy dead in the bathtub. The water was red with blood. Marcus did this. He killed his own brother. So then... Jesus. So now this person just pretty much wants to die because they're tired of being terrified all the time. Which, you know, I guess you get to that point after being terrorized by whatever the hell's going on in this house for so long. Why are you moving, statue? Oh, sh Jesus Christ. What the hell just opened? There's literally nothing nearby here. June 27th, 1983. Marcus came home from work today seeming really flustered. Where did when this I come asked from? What was wrong, he yelled at me and threw the bird's cage to the floor. But it was our first pet together. July 1st, 1983. I don't understand why Marcus has been so strict. The police found Marcus dead in his own classroom. Interesting. Nothing going on up in here? Good, let's get the hell out of here. Turn that off. I don't want to drain my battery any more than it's going to drain. So pretty mild so far. I had already 
had the crap scared out of me like 17 times this far into the game, my first two playthroughs. Batteries are getting low. Uh, I better charge it when I go to bed tonight. Nothing going on up in here. Still a creepy ass picture on the wall, so that's good. Michael Jackson, gotta love that. Creepy mannequin picture. Oh, look, it's my dog. Wait a minute. I thought my dog was dead. Alright, well, let's ignore that. I'm not gonna ask questions about that. Everything looks pretty normal in here. Let's close the door just to entice the ghosts of the bathroom. What? I. I was just looking at the toilet. Bathroom here. Oh, I can see me, sort of. I'm like a blue. A blue haze. I'm gonna go to bed. Oh, that's wonderful. Mannequins have moved downstairs. So far, nothing. I'm pretty happy with that. Nothing else really. It's just a quiet night in my house tonight. What is that noise? Oh, and we're okay still. Good, I'm getting kind of tired of randomly being killed in the middle of the night by a floating shadow. The bathroom's still good? Who's in there? Who's in the toilet? Oh, is there blood coming out of the bottom of my toilet? Got a little bit of a plumbing problem there, I guess. Chair, okay, good. Michael Jackson's still chilling up. That mannequin just moved in the picture, so let's get the hell out of here. Hey, guys. There's a mannequin up there already. Gets me every time. Let's go check the garage. The garage. September 11th, 1984. He's toying with me. Every time I cry, he makes the house shake. I can't do anything. The door won't open. I'm trapped. She's begging Marcus to let her die. Because apparently he killed the baby. Wow, that's pretty friggin' intense, actually. You know some messed up shit's going down when some guy up, some ghost up and kills a baby. June 20th. Okay, so there is a page there. Okay, we're we're good. There's just nothing up here. Not even at the back. That's as risky as I'm willing to go. Okay, so I don't really know what's the, what the dip I think if <laughs> the fuck that actually gave me a good jump. Okay. They turn my sink on again. I hear a draining sound effect, but nothing actually drained. July 4th, 1984. I hear the fireworks outside. As the people likely stare and wonder, I loathe them. Loud, bright, and pointless. Is my All the pictures of Jeremy were shattered. She knows Marcus is watching her. So there is, I think if you choose the full version, there's supposed to be more days, there's supposed to be, it sort of like, paces out the scares a little bit. I just want to go make sure my dog <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> Shit. Uh, so my dog is dead, yet it's laying in my bedroom. 
probably something I should be worried about. Jesus, what the hell was that? Oh, I see you're uh, on door duty. Built during a prohibition, cellar was a brewery and a brothel. Many owners sell the house within one year of living here. For reasons unknown, deaths. A Sarah Foreman, a sex slave, was murdered in the cellar. Her jaw and tongue had been removed. She was left to die alone, bleeding. Jeremy Flint was found dead in the bathtub. Jennifer Flint was found dead in the kitchen, impaled by exposed pipes. An unnamed infant was found dead in the attic. That's never really a good thing. Ever. Alright, well. That sounds promising. Hey, you silly goose. Can you get out of my way, please? I really want to live long enough to find out what's in that basement. I've been thinking about it. What is going on here? And please just let me wake up. Like this. Okay, the normal route. I'm gonna use the Ouija board just because I'm risky. L. Leave. Is it gonna say leave? Of course it is. Well, this is my house, so. No. I'm not going anywhere. Do you know how much I paid for this place? Apparently too much. Oh. My God. Or can I just. Alright. So. Not, what good ever happens in the bathroom honestly. Oh god! Let me out, please. Fuck. Fuck. Shit. Turn those back on. Let me out. 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 Why can't I get out? Oh. Oh, sweet Jesus. What was. 135, right? 135? 135. Ah, every time. Okay. Get out of here. See, I think... Oh, the, the friggin' mannequin disappeared from the picture. I think I'm gonna die tonight. So I gotta get into the basement. 135. 135. 135. 135. 135. 135. Oh, shit, no. 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 House is evil. Yes, I know. Trust me, I know. No, what can I do? What can I do? One, three, five. Yes, give me that key. Gimme, give gimme give the key to the basement. Finally! Thank you. We're getting somewhere. Let's get down to the basement. ASAP. Ah! 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 I saw a shadow of a woman. 
Oh, I still see it! Oh, it's the shadow of that thing. Okay, I'm just super paranoid. Okay. Okay. We're gonna go down here, okay? We're gonna go through this together. Alright. Oh no! No, 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 no! Okay, that wasn't. That wasn't too bad. Is she gone? Shit. December 21st, 1984. I've been returning to that room in the basement every day since the deaths. It makes me feel better, more at peace. December 23rd, 1984. The woman from the hidden room has been following me ever since I saw her. The presence I've been feeling isn't Marcus, it never was. She kills everyone I love. Why? What have I done, God? December 25th, 1984. That's how they spell Christmas? Christmas is just another okay. That Jesus I can forgive that. Damn about Christmas is apparently a really hard Satan's word to spell. killed everyone I love, and now she stalks me, follows me, haunts me. January 11th, 1985. I have the urge to kill. Is my mind being tainted? Is my very soul being perverted and contorted by this evil place? Why did I ever set foot in that room? This sounds this just awful. Marcus acted so strangely before he died. Is the same thing happening to me? Hello? January 15th, 1985. If anybody reads this, I apologize for anything I've done. Destroy the house, gas leak, utility closet, basement. Stop this evil. Oh no. I can't move. I can't friggin' move. What is happening? Am I dead? Am I? Oh shit! Am I dead? I'm probably dead. Oh Jesus Christ! Please just get out of here, you faceless freak! Oh, I'm not dead. I'm alive. Plot twist. I'm gonna follow that letter. I gotta burn this house down. This I assume. Yes! Turn that shit! Get out of here! Get out of here before the gas that kills everyone! I can't get out of here! Burn this shit to the ground! Here we go! I think we finally did it! Oh, she's still here. Did I win? Did I do it? Three hours ago, we successfully stopped the fire at the house. One set of human remains was found in the basement of the home. The nature of the fire appears to be gas related and purely accidental. So the matter will be investigated thoroughly awesome. by our department. The deceased has been identified as Mattel Clark. I love news channel music. Always a tragedy when something like that happens. On a brighter note, 
The weather on the coast is set to keep the sun shining. He died terribly. This weekend will be the perfect on a positive note. The beach. And now here's your party with sports. Yes! Yes, we did it! So since I purchased it, um, apparently I get all content updates for free. So when they come out, I'll be sure to take another go at this. Wow, what a fantastic game. Matt Cohen really, like, outdid himself on this. Great job, honestly. It's one of the better scary horror indie games that I've played. Really awesome. I'm really glad I decided to come back to this. There wasn't as many, like, jump scares, but I'm sure if I would have chose the unabridged version, I would have got... You know what? I, I did say this episode would be longer than the others. We'll do the um, abridged version to skip between the two, just so anyone who's considering buying this game can compare the two. It's uh, Friday. I want to know if the jump scares are more frequent. Oh, we're just, we're just jumping right... Woman in the doorway! Let's go find her! Hey, beautiful! Oh, she's gone. Okay. I'm not necessarily upset about that. Anything going on in here? No? Good. So, they're wasting my water again. Not this time, ghosts. So what's that lady? She's pure evil. Let's go into the attic because I hate myself. <coughs> that was sort of terrifying. Nothing in there. I mean, I'm not going to explore in there just because... I'm a gigantic baby, but let's check the garage. Oh. Man, yeah, there's a little bit more activity so far. More often. Leave. Mm, I don't think so. What's that? Whoa. <laughs> Shit. Oh. <laughs> that was... That actually got me. Probably shouldn't have, but it did. Oh, that mannequin moved. Is it the one from the... Nope, just another mannequin. I have an interesting clock. Let's follow the bloody footsteps, because when has that ever been a bad idea? Beat it, thriller. And my dead dog still just chilling in my bedroom. Like, is he not even going to mention it? Like, I'm going to use the Ouija board gonna say leave again yep leave I'm kind of just like intentionally pissing off this woman at this point because I'm pretty sure like I said before Ouija boards like invite a spirit into your home can I use it more than once no I can't use it more than once in one day hello I wonder if the password. I'm gonna chair again. I wonder if the password would remain the same for that safe. Have I found the safe in this one? Oh, hey, look, you guys are here. Hey, guys, how's it going? I'm gonna hear footsteps running up the stairs, right? Safe. Where did that come from? Oh, 
it was one three five it changes two three batteries five? are getting low now I better charge it one to bed four five one four six two four six two three six two three five I'm a persistent bastard. One, four, six. Three, five. One, three, six. Well, whatever then. Screw you. I don't care. I'm gonna run upstairs and go to bed. What? What? What is it? What's your ish, buddy? Hey, friendo. Run, run. Run, run, run. Let's go to bed. We got very low battery. Stop moving my furniture! You're so evil. I'm gonna have to spend like... 10 seconds moving that stool back, you evil bastards. Hello. I would tell you to come in, but I know you're going to anyways. There you Oh, this again. Okay, good, because... That was terrifying. Ouija board just to see what the spirits think of me now. What do you think of me now, spirits? Oh, you're gonna say Marcus. I remember this one. Marcus. So the woman hates Marcus too. The sex slave. The sex slave was the killer all along. Baby, baby, I'm one, four, five. Yo, baby, how you d d d doing? <laughs> I'll have you know that my mouthwash is rated ten out of ten. By the National Mouthwash Rating Board. Mannequin outside my door. I'm ready for you this time. I knew you were going to be there. You didn't scare me this time, buddy. Fall over. I need to get out of here. So the, there has been like more s noise jump scares. Okay, so nothing. See you there, you creepy bastards. Oh, I already forgot. I already forgot the password. It was like, uh... Jesus, do we have, like, enough crap going on in my house? There's definitely more activity. Okay, still nothing in the attic. It was like, oh, it was like a oh, one, one, four, five, right? It was something like that. Can I have another shot at opening this? One, four, five. Nice. 
This must be the key to the basement. Gonna do it again! What now? Just go your own way, lady. I don't want I don't want any trouble, seriously. God, head bob, what are you doing? Sarah. That's kind of a little bit of a disturbing picture. What? What? Where? Where is this fire that you're so I called to laugh at you eerily. I have the key to the basement. Can I go in there yet? Okay, did I grab, like, actually grab the key? I did! So why won't you let me open up this door? I'm... What do you want from me? Do you want me to go into the, you want me to go into the attic? I'll go into the attic. There is nothing in the attic. I have been in the attic, okay? There's nothing in there. I got the window to the safe. I got the basement key. Finally! I don't I hate this. I don't want to look at you. She creeps me out. She's like that girl from the grudge who got her jaw ripped off. There it is. December. It tells me to just I don't want to see your face. You just stay away. Hey, lady. These headphones are really loud. Just chewing on my face or beating on my neck or whatever. But I'm okay, it was all a trick of the mind. Run, run, run. Run, run, run. Light this. Well, you didn't even give me a second to look around that time. Man, you are creepy! I know it's terrible but we did it I'm gonna now that we did it I'm going to jump back to the entrance okay so like I said I'm gonna try and come back to this once there's more content updates for it but until then as always take care of yourself and try and stay in the electric mindset see you later everybody